Hey guys, it's Craig again. I want to do an update on XMR because there's a user, uh, Jamil, I think is his name. And um, he got out on the uh, thing. And uh, I was just trying to relate to you, man. Don't worry about it, dude. There's going to be more opportunities on this coin. Okay. This thing's going down to 100. It's going to break probably that $130 level. So you got room to play, man. So practice your shorts on this coin. This is actually a really good coin, in my opinion, to be doing shorts on. People over there screwing around BTC. You know, I know BTC is going to go down, man. But, dude, looking at that chart, that thing likes to play with your mind, man. Go with those easier charts. Charts that make more sense. At least I do. Uh, okay, I want to give you an update on the uh, XMR. Um, what, what's going on here? Let me go down to the 30-minute, and I'll let you know. This, uh, this coin is in its in a third wave, okay? So... What is going on with this coin is here is a one, two, three, four, and it's going down into a fifth. I think it's going to land about 245, maybe even uh, 238. Okay, but once it completes that fifth, and I'll show you, you see, it's going to come make that bearish divergent or bullet. Yeah, no, what is that? Bullish divergence, excuse me, bullish divergence. So it's going to come down and there's going to be another bounce about the same size as that okay and here is going to be the interesting thing about this coin is that if you take that wave one and go to that wave two if it does land there 245 or this area this fifth wave i'm gonna probably get in on this this fifth wave because this fifth wave may extend okay so um just to give you an area of a possibility on this coin so you want to go the whole length of wave three and just say it pops up there the fifth wave could extend down to 229 okay like that so it could extend like that just because these these legs didn't extend you know and it's a normal looking third wave to me so it might be a plan for you, Jamil, load up maybe a little bit right here, whatever you feel comfortable with, you know. Fourth wave, you could have a stop loss up at like maybe 255. It could go up into that other wave, but it should be about the same size, more or less, might drag out a little bit more as that wave right there, this one. Okay. And the overall picture on this is that this is turning out to be um this where it came down from one two and this will be three and this will be another area you see that there's going to be another nice bounce right here on that wave and then this this fifth wave will be a nice wave to ride down okay so yeah and then you know and that's not going to be the end of it man that's not going to be the end of it I mean, at a minimum, at a minimum, it's going to be this. A up for B, another bounce, and a C. So it's a minimum that. And we're not even, look at this, look at this coin. You know, it's got a correct, this is a corrective move. It's going to break that. So don't panic, Jamil. You got plenty of room to go. I'm not worried about it, man. So um enjoy the gains thanks for watching peace